Welcome back. Well, the COVID pandemic changed the way Americans work and live, and that couldn't be more true for St. Joseph resident Kelly Evans. It wasn't until the COVID-19 shutdown that this local cosmetologist found her niche in telling true crime stories. And now her estimated 20,000 listeners following her are 95% women between the ages of 28 and 45. KQ2's Jody O'Brien uncovers her story of how I justify working and cleaning because I'm like, well, if I'm like kind of, you know, listening to a story and familiarizing myself with it um, while I'm cleaning. If she's picked up one toy, she's picked up hundreds and bottles. She's washed her fair share, but this mom of three isn't slowing down anytime soon. <laughs> She has too many people around the world waiting on the next Mama Mystery podcast episode. But unfortunately, her body was so damaged that they weren't able to determine how she died. To the tune of hitting one million downloads of true crime. Combine a passion, a pandemic, podcast popularity, and posting on social media. And it has equaled success. And at the time, this is like 2020, 2021. I was like, I don't even know what a podcast is. I don't listen to podcasts. I wouldn't know the first thing about how to do that. But I quickly figured it out. I was able to teach myself. I learned a lot through YouTube and just, I don't know, a lot of trial and error. People think this happens overnight and they go, oh my God, that happened so fast. Well, it happened after three years of commitment. So. For many of us moms, the best part of Kelly's job is she gets to close the door. Contrary to what her children assume, what goes on behind closed doors is far from self-care. Obviously, this is a fun space. It looks like a living room, kind of. So I think it was hard for them to be like, are you really working in there? Are you just hanging out, watching Bravo? But as Evans brings to light women's greatest fears, she also feels deeply for the victim's families. And I reached out to her mom just to see if I could ask her some questions, and she responded to me. Um, Chance Engelbert is another um, boy who went missing from Nebraska, and his story was really big, and his mom reached out to me as well, or responded to me. So, I mean, I, I value celebrities and the like what they're able to do for the podcast, but I also truly do value the victims' families. Jody O'Brien, KQ2 News. And Evans recently signed a contract with Cloud10 Media, which is a sister station to iHeartRadio, the biggest streaming platform.